Okay, this here is the, for the operator um, every day. There's an operator here 365 days a year. And what they do, this is our SCADA system. It shows you our elevated storage tanks that are downtown. This one here, Bridge Street, is actually offline right now. Um, in the near future, we're able to look at taking that down because we have our Fry Street tank, which is a two million gallon, is enough to be able to supply pretty much uh, most of the city, most of the city of Valdosta, without having that one. So, a high school tank. It shows you where your, how much water is in there, your level there. Pretty much, they're over halfway full right now. As you go through this, the ground storage tanks, where I was talking about, holds 1.5 MGD a piece. Those are there, one, two, and three. Right now, we're going by number one. It actually shows your high service pumps. Right now we're running number seven high service pump. So as you're, if you want to know what the pressure is going to town, right now we're at 63.0 PSI. Um, sometimes that fluctuates to 65, 66. The main thing that we're concerned about here since we have the Fry Street tank online, which is a lot of water, two million gallons of water, is trying to get a better turnover as much as we can in that tank, as I talked about before in the ground storage tanks. So what we try to do is drop this tank as much as we can during the day and then fill this tank back up at night to be able to get fresh water in that tank so you got better turnover. So that's one reason we, our pressure used to be around 65, 66, but right now it's like 63 sometimes because we're trying to um, drain that tank and then tonight they run a little bit higher trying to fill it back up. But this is where it shows all your chemicals, and for each, there's your caustic. It shows you which pumps are running. Um, and talking about something I felt mentioned on the hydrosulfide on the strippers part, we have sodium hypochlorite, which I, we talked about how we make our own. Five of those pumps go to each scrubber. There's five scrubbers, and then we also have caustic which we have five of the caustic pumps that actually go to the scrubbers because what happens is the hydrosulfide gets in those scrubbers and it just it's just nasty and that helps clean those scrubbers up is what it's used for so i felt to really uh, mention that to you earlier but it shows each one of our processes of sodium hypochlorite um, we have two pumps that are goes to our system and then we have the other five um, that goes to the scrubber so we always have constantly um, hypochlorite going to the city. As we produce a 0.8% of sodium hypochlorite, we leave here at the plant at a 1.8 million gallons per liter or PPM, whichever one you want, part per million, here at the plant. So, um, it, and we're looking at putting in uh, booster pumps and um, in the cities because there's some places that are, you know, you, you figure that we're leaving here at the plant at a chlorine and trying to get you know, all the way through the city. So we're looking at doing that here in the near future. But this is where they monitor everything, the pressure, the tanks here, and also our ozone, they're able to monitor it here as well. So this is just a panel view. They know how many uh, pounds per day producing. And ozone will usually go by 100 pounds of ozone per well. So um, that's basically our calculation there. It will usually go by, but it shows you um, our destruct, um, which is on top here is also it destroys what's left of the of ozone because ozone is very corrosive it will if you get enough of it it will you just can't breathe I mean it just like collapses your lungs so the destruct destroys what's left after it goes through the ozone contactor it destroys the re what's remaining so that's uh, one of our safety factors for, for the ozone um, disinfectant that we use here is our destruct unit because if it's not working right then the whole thing is all automated nothing will start the way it's supposed to it has to be in order for it to all work together so is there any questions okay if you have anything that you think of 
throughout the yeah. day. Make sure you can get a hold of me. I'll probably be easier when I get a contact and we'll get you an answer as quickly as possible. So just let us know. If you forget something, we can answer it real quickly. Thank you.